Drill Tech truly is a heavy civil construction company. Uh, last year we started 108 projects in the U.S. and one mining project. Driving tunnels, sinking shafts, whether it's for a water tunnel or for a gold mine, it's all the same. The principles don't change a bit. I've been in drill blast uh, development my entire career and the first road header tunnel that we drove in Grable, Wyoming, uh, you could see the benefit to cutting with the road header versus drill blast. Especially, you know, if you wanted a 20, 30 year life of mine type of tunnel, that this was the way to go. The bolting is much easier because the walls in the back are smooth. The floor is smooth and cut to grade. Uh, if you hit a soft spot with drill blast, you could have an undulating floor and hard to keep uh, fill in and keep your ramps in shape where the road header does it all for you. With the road header, you just don't see the blast damage. You don't shock the ground, you're just carving it out and it gives you a much better profile to put your ground support in. Uh, your grade is cut perfectly. It's easier to keep your road beds in, keep your ramps in shape. They're just, there's a lot of benefits to road header versus drill blast. If you have a machine that can cut the rock. The MH620 is, is heavy enough to stay put. The road header itself stays stable and doesn't move around and jump around and beat itself to death. So it's, a, it's a great machine for the harder type material. Both declines are projected to be 7,200 feet long. Uh, straight as an arrow, nominally 15% decline. One of the reasons for the road header and the geodata and the auto cut was we're driving right to design. The tunnels have to be straight, extremely straight. We're cutting perfectly to design. And that's what it needs to be is straight for them to place a conveyor 7,200 feet long uh, if you're off just a little bit, that, that conveyor isn't going to fit in that tunnel and come all the way out. So it's allowed very accurate tunneling. The purpose is to, for Barrick to be able to go deeper, eliminate the high cost truck haulage out of the existing portals. And the east tunnel here will have a conveyor in it that conveyors their rock out at a much cheaper price per ton, you know. The lead man on this crew uh, after he first cut with the auto cut, and Darren's a 30-year mining guy, said, uh, you know, I hate to admit it, but I finally found something electronic that can do a job better than I can. He said, I love the auto cut, you know, because it just gives you a perfect profile. We're maybe one, two percent over break, or maybe under, it's cutting a very, very nice tunnel. We're very proud of our workforce and the job they're doing here. I believe Barrick's very pleased with our performance, uh, both health and safety wise and production wise. So it's a, it's a good marriage here. We're having fun. We have a lot of fun here. We really do.